Hi there, this tutorial is for people using Carrot Shop, the sponge plugin, uh, for the very first time. This plugin is very, very similar to the old one called uh, Sign Shops for 1.710 and 1.6.4. Works very much the same. So if you're setting up your nice new shop at Spawn or wherever on your server, um, you're going to have two sets of signs, or three. Um, one for buying items, for or, s or one for selling, and then there's also one for trading as well. That one's very new, that one's new to Carrot Shop. Um, the way you look at these, the buy and sell, you're looking at it from your customer's point of view. So if you, if your customer wants to buy something from you, you want to use the buy sign. If you want to, your customer wants to sell something to you, you use the sell sign. So I'm going to set up a really quick shop for cobblestone. So the first line is always buy in square brackets. I, I don't think capitals matter, but that's uh, I haven't actually tested that before. So the next two lines, the two middle ones, don't matter at all. You can put whatever you like in there. But there's probably a rule on most servers that you have to put an accurate sign in there so you know what you're buying. So I usually go with what it is and then how much you're selling and then the price. So five dollars. So I'm using dollars on this server so it'll always be that. I don't think you need the dollar sign but I always put it in. Okay so what you're going to do is put the amount of cobble you're selling or whatever the item is you, that you're selling into the first chest. Now if you want to sell just one stack of cobblestone you want to just put one stack inside that chest. If you put more than one stack in the sign will think that you're trying to sell more than one stack at once. So we're just going to put the one in and then we're going to punch it with a piece of redstone and then we're going to punch the sign and that will link up the shop. Now if you're if you want to have your signs and chests in completely different places go right ahead. As long as both places are loaded they'll be fine. See what I usually do with my ch with my shops is I put a section on the ground just for the chests and then so up the top all there is is just signs. Now you can break these like any other sign absolutely fine. Um, so you want to make sure that they're protected. So for making sell sign shops you basically do exactly the same you just put sell in the top. Just remember to take the cobblestone out afterwards. <laughs> so and that's it for the buy and sell signs. If you're setting up admin shops use I before the buy and the sell between the brackets and then you can destroy the, sh the chests afterwards. Now this new thing that the carrot shop has added is trading which I think is super cool. So what we're going to do is we're going to put trade at the top and then the next three signs again they don't matter the next three lines even. So we're going to put on here 64 cobblestone for uh, 64 dirt. So we're going to put 64 cobblestone in our first chest and then 64 dirt in the other one and then you want to click on both of them and then click the sign. So now if we take the cobblestone out we click on the chest and we've got dirt instead. Bob's your uncle. Now another awesome awesome feature and probably my favorite feature about Carrot Shop compared to all the other sign shop plugins is the report. Now I can't really show you this because I don't actually have any proper shops on this server yet but if you do CR it'll generate a report and then you click on this and it takes you into a, a really cool web page which will show everything that people have bought and sold over the last I think it's week maybe two um, I think it's in the config and uh, anyone can do that if they have the permission to do it and it is again seriously cool if you like stats and um, I think that's it for this tutorial uh, this is the first one I made in probably two or three years now so I'm sorry if it's a bit terrible uh, this was recorded on my third modded server Arcana Technologies on Dragon Tech 
and see again my community. Um, so if you like this tutorial and you think I'm awesome, which I'm not really, but still, uh, come and check out my server. Okay, and uh, that's it, I think. Have a great day.